if a sum of rupees 1600 gives a simple interest of rupees 252 in two years and three months find the rate percent per annum so here we have been given the principal amount which is rupees 1600 we have also been given the simple interest that we are getting at the end of two years and three months and now we have to find the rate percent per annum so we know the formula for simple interest which is simple interest is equal to principal multiplied by the rate multiplied by the time divided by 100 now in this formula time is expressed in terms of years and rate is expressed in terms of percentage per annum or per annum means per year now in this example the time frame given to us is two years and three months so we have to convert this in terms of years so two years and three months is how many years so two years plus three months so this is expressed in terms of years but this has been expressed in terms of months so we have to convert this three months in terms of years now we know that 12 months is one year so three months will be how much so again cross multiplication here so 3 multiplied by 1 is equal to 12 multiplied by x so x is equal to 3 divided by 12 or this is 1 divided by 4 so this becomes 2 years plus 1 by 4 years so this is 2 plus 1 by 4 so we can take 4 as the LCM so this is 2 by 1 so 1 4s are 4 and then 4 multiplied by 2 is 8 so 8 plus 1 which is equal to 9 by 4 or in other terms you can also express this as so 4 2s are 8 so 2 here and then remaining is 1 that is 9 minus 8 is 1 so 2 1 by 4 or this is also equal to 2.25 years because 1 by 4 is 0.25 so 2 plus 0.25 is 2.25 years now you have to be very careful that 2 years and 3 months is not equal to 2.3 years because 2.3 years means this is 2 plus 0 0.3 which means 2 plus 3 by 10 so this is wrong because this is in terms of months and we have 12 months in a year and not 10 so this is wrong so now let's put this information that we now know in this formula so simple interest is 252 and this is equal to principal which is 1600 multiplied by rate which we have to find so let's assume rate is r percent per annum multiplied by the time frame in years which is 9 by 4 and this divided by 100 so or so here we can cancel this two zeros in the numerator and the denominator and four fours are 16 so our equation becomes 252 is equal to 4 multiplied by r multiplied by 9 so let's put r on one side of this equation and all the numbers on the other side so we have r is equal to so 4 and 9 will go to the other side and become the denominators so 252 divided by 4 multiplied by 9 now let's divide 
252 by 4. So 6 4s are 24. So this becomes 6. And then 25 minus 24 is 1. So 1 carry over. And 4 3s are 12. So 63. Now we know that 63 is divisible by 9. So 9 7s are 63. So R is equal to 7 percent per annum. So this is the rate percent which will give us an interest of 252 rupees in 2 years 3 months if we deposit a sum of rupees 1600 at simple interest.